This is a make or break attempt by the EU to control migration. So how would it work? Well, at the moment, only a few European countries, Spain, Italy and Greece, are responsible for the vast majority of asylum applications. Now, this agreement brings in a new solidarity mechanism. Essentially, it's a trade-off. So the countries receiving most migrants will build detention centres on the EU's external borders. What that means is that migrants would be screened when they arrive and authorities would have the option to detain them until their asylum claims are assessed. And if those claims are rejected, the migrants can be sent to a third country deemed safe. But in return, other European countries like France, Germany and Poland will have to accept more refugees or send extra money for border infrastructure. Now, most NGOs dealing with migrations have called this pact cruel. Amnesty International, for example, says that it will lead to a surge in suffering for asylum seekers. Now, the worry is that this new scheme will encourage more detention, including of children and families. But the EU says that it could lead to a breakthrough because a higher number of asylum claims being fast-tracked at the EU's external borders would lead to quicker and more efficient ways of returning illegal migrants.